Hello students, welcome back to our channel. So here in this video, we are going to discuss the FA1 unit number 4, 4 marks problematic questions. So by watching this video, if any type of problematic questions they are asking for 4 marks means definitely you are going to attempt it. Clear? So log whatever the problematic question you have already learned the same thing you will have in the short also you're not having any difference in that okay let's discuss the video so in this video uh, definitely you're going to achieve a four marks weightage so don't skip the video and watch till the end so a company purchased a plant on 1st april 2018 for 1 lakh rupees depreciation is written off 10% under straight line method. So straight line method is nothing about first method. Straight line method or original cost method or fixed installment method is one and the same. Calculate till 2020, 2018 to 2020. You need to calculate under straight line method. So simple thing. Ma. So first 2018. Okay. 2018 April 1st. So April 1st is opening means... So, from April to 31st, December will be the closing, no? So, first April is, see, here, to bank account. Only one missionary is there. What is the amount? 1 lakh rupees. Okay. So, 2018, December 31st, by depreciation account. So, from April to December, okay? So, April to December, we need to do it. See here. What is the thing is 1 lakh into 10 percent no. So 1 lakh into 10 percent is 10,000 rupees. So 10,000 rupees is the amount. Okay. But the thing is if December is the op closing amount is April. April they have purchased. December is the closing. But they have only used April, May, June, July, August, September, October, November, December. 3, 6, 9. 9 months only they have been used. No. So simply what we need to do? 1 lakh into 10% into 9 divided by 12. Why? Because they have used only 9 months. Okay. So 1 lakh into 10% into 9 divided by 12. 7500 is the amount. Okay. So simple thing. 1 lakh on the both the sides. 1 lakh minus 7500. How much you are getting? 92,500. So this will be the balance carried out. That's it. Straight line method. No. Now after this next to month. Next to month. 2018 after we will get 2019. 2019 January 1st. First will be to balance brought down that is 92,500. Okay. So January to December 31st. No. So by depreciation account. So from January to December 12 months. Okay. So what is the original method? Original cost method that is straight line method. No. So 1 lakh into 10%. So 1 lakh into 10% if you are doing this, you will get 10,000 rupees. So this will be the fixed. Next, by balance, carry down. So 92,000 minus 10,000 is 82,500. So that is the thing. 92,500. 92,500. That's it. Okay. After 2018 and 2019, you will get 2020. So 2020, January 1st. That will become to balance brought down 82,500. Okay. So, December 31st will become the by depreciation account. That is 10,000 only because on the original cost method only we need to do no. So, 12 months you have used 10, 1 lakh into 10,000. 10% is 10,000 only. And balancing figure will be 72,500. So, balance carry down is. 72,500. So, 82,500 on the both the sides. 82,500 on the both the sides. So, 2020 we have been no. We need to bring it to the 2021. So, 2021 January 1st. To balance brought down 72,500. That's it. 
clear so like this you need to do the four marks answer same like long whatever we have done the same thing you need to do it for the short also this is the first important uh, uh, problematic question definitely if they are asking problematic means definitely this type of problematic only they will ask now we will do the second question okay see here student this is the second important question calculate depreciation for four years on reducing method on missionary four lakhs or ten percent is a depreciation so reducing method is nothing about second method diminishing method or return down value method okay so you have not having any date no so that's why here i'm writing first only so to bank account so to bank account four lakh rupees okay so here also 31st december i you think uh, same year okay so by depreciation account so 10 percent means from first to 31st you have used any dates you have they have not mentioned no so that's why you need to consider full year so 4 lakh into 10 percent is nothing about 40,000 clear 40,000 so balancing figure will be 4 lakh minus 40,000 if you are doing means 3 lakh 60,000 clear so 40,000 on the 4 lakhs on the both the sides 4 lakhs 4 lakhs clear so now second one again first you are bringing it so to balance brought down 3 lakh 60,000 so for this 3 lakh 60,000 only we will do no in return down value method so whatever the carry down balance for that only we will do so 3 lakh 60,000 into 10 percent if you are doing means so 3 lakh 60,000 into 10 percent if you are doing means 36,000 you are getting so by depreciation account is 36,000 so 3 lakh 60,000 minus 36,000 if you are doing means 3 lakh 24,000 so this will become by balance carry down okay so 3 lakh 60 on the both the sides clear simple thing next again next year one two years over but they are asking for four years again two years you need to do it the same thing to balance brought down three lakh twenty four thousand for this three lakh twenty four thousand you need to do the depreciation so three lakh twenty four thousand into ten percent if you are doing means thirty two thousand four hundred you are getting so three lakh twenty four thousand minus thirty two thousand four hundred if you are doing means you will get two lakh ninety one thousand six hundred okay so you can use the calculator and you check out recheck once whether i am doing the correct or not okay one two three years is over next year again next to balance brought down two lakh ninety one thousand six hundred on 31st on this 2,91,600 you need to do the 10% depreciation that is 2,91,60 will be the answer. So by balance carry down is that means 2,91,600 minus 2,29,160 if you are doing means 2,62,440. So balancing figure is that so, total amount is 2,91,600. Okay, so next to, to balance brought down is 2,62,440. So, 1, 2, 3, 4 years and next year opening also we have done. Like this, you need to do the 4 marks problematic question. Definitely either they may ask a problematic question like this or like this. Definitely one question, definitely they will ask. So, if they are asking problematic from unit number 4 means this type of question only they will ask compulsory rather than this nothing will be asked. Okay. So, do this properly. Practice the questions and re-watch the videos if you have not understood anything means you re-watch the videos and this handwritten notes is available in our telegram group for free of cost. Clear? So, if you having any doubts let me know in the comment section all the very best for your examination as well as your preparation and uh, share this video with all your friends and subscribe to our channel okay you people are watching your people are getting the notes but you people are not subscribing to the channel so please do subscribe if you think this channel is worthy please do the subscribe okay so see you all in next video students bye bye everyone